So what's the story with Newsday Laura? She has been hypnotized before, but don't, doesn't want to get hypnotized with us? I guess, because I guess maybe she made an ass out of herself last <coughs> time. Make an ass out of herself here with me. I know. It'll be a lot of fun. I don't know why she's Stop taking and start giving, Newsday. Newsday, Laura, I get hypnotized. I'm going to be hypnotized this Friday. It's a blast. I love being hypnotized. Fez is dropping fact bombs today. But I'm telling you this. You will hear funny Fez on Friday. You're going to hear 1994 Ron and Ron show Fez Watley in here. Remember I used to come on the air, Fez, like a fucking buzzsaw. Right. Yep. So, yeah, I will go under, and then I will come back up. I will rise up again. Fez, let me hear Shakespeare in Fez Watley. To be or not to be, that is the question. Wow. That was fucking hideous. What was that voice you were doing? I thought it was kind of a Shakespearean voice. Eight six six Ron Zero Fez. Eight six six Ron Zero Fez. Here's Travis. You're on Ron and Fez. Hey buddy, um, I got a question for you, Ronnie. If Fez has no gaydar, is it possibly that he doesn't have a secret? <sighs> oh, that's that's incredibly possible. Matter of fact, I would go so far as if I was a betting man. Fez has no secret at all. Oh, I have a secret. I don't think so. Let me hear Shakespearean Fez. What light through yonder window breaks? It is the east, and you Juliet had... is the dawn. Have you had too much cheese? Uh, look who it is. Newsday, Laura. Laura? Hi, buddies. What's this story about you want to come up and you don't want to get hypnotized? No, I'll get hypnotized. You will get hypnotized. All right, so Chris Stanley's a bullshit liar. No, he's not, because I was a little trepidatious. Because well, it's not what were, what were you worrying about? Well, I, you know, I just, um, I don't know. I've been hypnotized before by Don, and, uh -huh. and it was fun, but, like, I don't know. I don't want to make an ass out of myself on the radio. Look, do not worry. The bit that I have planned with you is you're going to get naked, and we're going to urinate on you. So I don't want you to sit there and worry. No one's okay. going to make you into a victim. <laughs> all right. All right? And all, all right, you're really you know, going to have to do is lay there and take it. I'm, I'm down. Okay. I'll take it. Just for you, Ronnie B. All right. I appreciate it, Laura. So you're going to come in here Friday for the big hypnosis show. Yep, I'll be there. Uh, we got enough people to be hypnotized. Do you got enough in the uh, uh, in the audience right now, Hicks? We're filling up pretty quickly. I may have a couple more seats, two or three left over for people to come in. All right, 202 Friends is the place to go. 202 Friends, if you'd like to come in and watch uh, Laura get hypnotized, do me a favor, though, if you're in the audience. Don't urinate before the show because you may end up be part of it with Laura. <laughs> Sweet. All right, Will we be there? To urinate on me? Who's that? Will Lee Mel's be there to urinate on me? Uh, Lee called the other day, but the new interns didn't know him. And I think he was more than just a little pissed off about it. That's not right. And then uh, the other problem with Lee is that when he comes into a room, he wants to take the doors off. <laughs> and um, apparently that's to put the guns through. <laughs> Have you seen him lately, Fez? No, not he lately. Look, he looks fantastic. He's he looks just great. All Last right. time I saw him, he had sleeves. Um, the singer. <laughs> I'm here with Lee Mills. Um, all right, Laura. We'll see you on Friday. See you Friday, buddies. Bye bye.